How's it going? Welcome to a what if we've got the Brazilian center back Marcelo seems to be pretty popular in packs as well as the uh, Les Melu. Uh, but yeah, this card's already guaranteed to get plus two. Uh, Leon just kept a clean sheet in a one nil win against uh, Rennes. So uh, I mean, the card itself already looked decent. You know, decent pace. Uh, pretty you know very good defending and physicals uh decent passing as well so i mean with that upgrade he will look to be a very you know good top option for your teams uh but yeah his price is already starting to increase it's going up to around 120 to 130k which is like a 20k increase uh so that is of course expected just due to the hype uh but yeah hopefully we get this upgrade pretty soon and hopefully we don't have to wait too long uh, like most of the time we do, because EA does like to take a while to uh, change that. But uh, yeah, we'll get into the stats. So we'll start out with the pace. Uh, 77 acceleration and, and 73 sprint speed. Uh, I'd probably say that's quite average. You know, he's just got enough pace to manage and hold his own and keep up with those attackers. Uh, but definitely boost it with a chemistry style. And after that boost, he'll definitely feel, you know, obviously much quicker. Uh, you can go with a shadow, a catalyst, whatever you want to do. You can max out the defending, or you could boost up the passing. Um, on the ball, uh, you know, obviously he's quite heavy, quite clunky, and you can definitely feel that when defending and jockeying. But uh, you know, I didn't think it was too much of an issue. I mean, if it was a, if you know, I did have to pick out a con, it'd probably be that. But that's expected with these bigger center backs who have a bigger frame uh, and cover more space. So you know, he makes up with that with his size. Um, and then, you know, he's got the 84 reactions, which is decent, especially important in those defensive situations. Uh, 80 ball control and 83 composure. Uh, the composure, very noticeable in terms of playing out of the back. He's a very good ball playing center back. Uh, and when you win possession, you know, you won't lose possession while trying to play from, you know, your own third. So it's obviously a very important trait for your defenders. Uh, he's got the 88 long pass and 84, uh, 85 short pass. So those are like stats of like a midfielder. So that's, you know, very good. Um, defensively, uh, he's got the 89 interceptions, 84 defensive awareness, which is pretty good. Uh, but I would say he's more of a tackler. His stand tackling was very good. He's got 94 stand tackle. Uh, and with that 93 aggression, you know, he... Uh, his defending definitely feels much better than what it actually is. You know, the aggression is very key in this game. And yeah, defensively, I mean, he's his slide tackle as well is not too bad either um, at 83. But uh, yeah, defensively, his tackling it was really the, the key, the standout defensive stats. And then he's got the 98 strength. So he is a tank. You know, he won't let anyone get through him. He's a wall and he really does bully the attackers running at him. Uh, you know, if they just try to get through him, they'll most of the time end up on the floor. And then in the air, you know, he's got the power header trait, being at six foot three with the 93 jumping and 99 heading accuracy. Uh, not only will he win all his 50-50 duels, so maybe if some, like, if the goalkeeper bombs it forward, uh, he'll definitely win that duel against the attacker, but off, also offset pieces, off corners, he can be a constant threat and, you know, chip in with a few goals. Uh, but yeah, this card uh, is very similar if maybe you guys have tried like Hierro because, you know, he's got the very good aerial ability and then uh, good defensive stats, a bit low on the slide tackle, but looks very similar to that. So if you've used it, it's a very similar card. But yeah, I mean, for the price, I think it's a very good center back option. Definitely one of the top options in Ligue 1 and for Brazil. So yeah, I would definitely recommend trying them out. So that's going to be my review. Please like, of course, subscribe, comment down below who you'd like to see next, and thank you for watching.